One day at work, I was sitting on the couch with Jaakko. Typically, he, as the CEO, was browsing his phone while I was working hard on some code with my complete focus on it. However, I forget to lock my computer when I stepped away to get some water from the kitchen. While I was gone, Jaakko saw an opportunity to play a little prank on me. He took my laptop and sent out an email announcing that I was going to give free donuts to everyone in our company. Then he sat down and waited for the mayhem to unfold. Meanwhile, I was in the kitchen getting myself some water. I started to get notifications to my phone, and when I checked my inbox, I saw the flood of emails from my colleagues replying to the free donuts email. When I got back to my laptop, I realized what Jaakko had done. I felt a bit disappointed, but instead of letting it get best of me, I decided to take action. I started to develop a program that would automatically lock my computer whenever I step away from it. The basic idea of this Python program is to lock my computer whenever the tiecutting I'm wearing gets far enough from my computer. I will be using our Python library, AIO Taiga, which provides a very intuitive API for Taiga spatial user interface. Here is the GitHub repository of our library. I will be using the simple example as a starting point for my program. Let's copy and paste the example code into auto logout python source file. First, I will modify the Tiger client's host and credential information to match my host's local IP address. I hope that you use a stronger password than I'm using. Now, to start, I need to find out the location where I'm sitting right now. As with the simple example, we are interested in ring move events. These events happen every time the ring moves in the system. Here, we accept only events coming from our development ring named devring3. From the event itself, we can access the event location data by the event's position property. Here, I will simply modify the code to only print out the current location of the ring. Now, when we run this piece of code, we can see that the position property of our chosen ring is beautifully printed out to the terminal window. Since the data seems pretty consistent, we can just choose one sample and copy it and use it for the auto lockout feature in the future. Let's take this line over here. In the previous example, we only used this one line to print out the, the position of our chosen ring. Now, we will create a variable called PC location, which is a vector tree that can be imported from aiotaiga.utils module. We will save the measured x, y, and z coordinates in this variable. Now, Instead of just printing out the latest location of the chosen ring, we will import NumPy and use its Linux tools to calculate the distance between the latest location of the ring and our saved location. The current location of the ring can again be found from the event's location property. The saved location is in the PC location variable. We will create a simple logic that if the distance between the PC location and the ring is over 2 meters, we will lock out the computer. And if the distance is under 2 meters, we will unlock it. For this, we will use a helper of boolean with name away. So, when the distance is over 2 meters, the away variable will be set to true, and when it's under 2 meters, it will be set to false. Since I'm using Linux, I can use shell command loginctl to lock or unlock the current session. To run shell commands via Python, we also need to import the OS library. From the OS library, 
we can use the system command to run the uh, corresponding login CTL lock session and login CTL unlock session commands. This will lock and unlock the computer respectively. And that's it, the program is done. Now, whenever I take a break from coding, the laptop will be automatically locked. This will prevent Jaakko from pranking me again. Thanks for watching. I will attach links to the AAO Taika library and the code snippet created in this video to the video description below.